I'm Dave Short, the developer and manufacturer of Handypiece. In the past five years, we've sold many thousands of Handypieces to customers all around the world. The Handypiece was primarily being designed for crutching sheep and clipping cows, as in cows' tails. They have also been used for TB testing deer and any other animal clipping. I'd just like to show you what comes in the kit. First of all, of course, you've got the handpiece. It's got a belt, holster and pouch that goes around your waist. Screwdriver, oil bottle, a big lithium ion battery, a charger, which is like a laptop charger for a lithium battery. You've got a five meter extension cord for when you run out of power, you can hook it up to a vehicle as in your quad or truck or even another car battery. And it all comes in a very tidy, heavy duty bag. It's got steel around the edge, so it's a very firm casing. Now I'm just going to show you how the setup of it goes. The belt goes around your waist with the buckle at the back. We'll clip that on like that. Strap here around the leg so that the holster doesn't flop around. Battery slips into the pouch. And then you clip over top of it to stop it popping out. Strap here. The switch box goes anywhere along in front of it that you might like it. I like to have it there. Plug it in. It's got a little steel clip here and that just stops it from pulling apart. Basically you're ready to go. The holster is designed so that when you're pulling the pins back up you can drop the whole thing in there and away you go. Now, there's also the option that if your battery runs out, you can hook up the 5 metre extension cord. We advise to do this, that to uh, do a loop off the belt and then hook it onto the plug and that'll stop it pulling out when you're walking up and down the race. I'd just like to cover a few specifics about the battery. This is a 12 volt, 12 amp hour lithium ion battery. It's a big battery. When you're charging it, it will take two and a half hours to charge from fully empty. Now, it has no memory. So what that means is, if you are using it in the morning and say partially empty it, it's no problem to top it back up if you know you've got a big afternoon. Alternatively, if it's fully emptied in the morning, and you put it on the charger and only got an hour charge back into it, meaning it would be only about half charged, then it's okay also to use it again. The battery tends to suddenly turn off when it's near its end of its cycle. The other beauty of the battery is that once you're using it, for the whole time it has the same power, unlike lead acid batteries, it will be smooth all the way through it will only slow down from the last minute's use before it turns off. We like customers to be aware of the fact that a handy piece will never have the power of a 240 overhead machine. Therefore, to get the best out of your handy piece you need to run sharp gear on it and minimum tension. If you screw the tension down too much, like that, then it will be drawing a lot more power out of the battery and your battery will only last perhaps half the amount of time that it should. So be aware that sharp gear is the ticket with well lubed and minimum tension. Regarding the different ways of using the handypiece, there are several ways to have it set up around you. This is the best way to use it if you're standing in a race crutching as you're moving along and you can reach the switch very easily. However, if you're going to be shearing a few sheep, the best way to do that is to remove the switch box, put it on this side of your waist, then take the battery out. It comes with some tape around here, so just pull that off. Pop that back in, then 
you've got that around in front of you. Now, now what that will do is, if you're pulling sheep out and flipping them over, it's not going to hit the switch. It will also mean that you've got the cord down your right leg and it will not interfere with the sheep as you're doing it. What we do for guys who are going around shearing lifestyle blocks, we actually make a different type of handpiece for them that's got the cord coming off it going directly around your back. That way you've got no cord in front of you here. So the battery will sit on the middle of your back. This is only advised for guys who are going around shearing lifestyle blocks and we've now sold many hundreds of these for fellas who are doing that. Thank you.